How do you do? How do you do? I, I... How do you do? Uh, pardon. Do you feel not well? Forgive me for staring at you. I, I didn't... I, I mean looking at you in this way. It is all right. Fine. I'm uh, a painter, you see. Artist. Yes, good. An artist. Well, th- this is the impossible part. Here, y- you see these pictures? Huh? Oh, yes. Hmm. Very interesting. I mean, uh, not to know who it is, uh, his face. Oh, but I do know. I-, I didn't feel I could do the face before, but now I can. Oh, sure. Uh, why? Because it's your face. My face? <laughs> uh, what for, uh, uh, my face? Yes. Yes, I know it's queer, but it's... Uh, I mean, you are going to put my face in there? Yes. <laughs> well, all right. It's all right. Go ahead. You mean it? Now? Sure. Uh, uh, what do I do? I mean, uh... I am all right to uh, sit here like this? Yes, yes. Just just that way, please. Uh, if you'd tilt your head just a little more, that way. This is all right? Yes. Uh, uh, you're in the shadow, though. It, if there was only a little more light. Too dark. I have it. Would it would it be too much trouble if we change places? There's good light here where I'm sitting. Uh, pardon? If we change places, I'll sit over there and you... Oh, uh, change places? Sure. I sit down where he has been, and he places himself exactly where I've been sitting a moment before. For a moment, he looks at me, smiling. And then, it happens. There was a grinding, crashing thunder. Smoke and steam obscured his face, still smiling with surprise. And then an inferno of splintering wood and glass and rending steel came screaming at him, and the car slid into his place and got him shrieking his head. I killed him. didn't kill him. You know that now. You remember. You come back from the edge of reason. I'm going home. Sailing at midnight. It'll be midwinter. The snow on that Connecticut ridge. Those leafless elms in their rolling purple shadows. They gave me a farewell tea this afternoon, and I even had a cocktail. The hostess was much too busy to introduce us all around, but a very nice gentleman came up to me and introduced himself. My name is Grice. I'm a psychologist. I am Rachel Turner. I'm a painter. Suspense is transcribed and directed by Elliot Lewis, with music composed by Lucian Morrowick and conducted by Lud Gluskin. Death and Miss Turner was written for suspense by William Spear. In tonight's story, Jeanette Nolan was heard as Miss Briggs, Joseph Kearns as Dr. Grice, Paul Freeze as the man on the train, and Charles Davis as the shopkeeper. Agnes Moorhead may currently be seen touring in Don Juan in Hell by George Bernard Shaw. <laughs> 